If you look at the fossil record, you'll see there's changes in the golden mean structure in the fossil record, especially in seashells. And if you examine and observe that change, you can work out the nature of the physics laws, the new physics laws guiding healthy biological growth and development through space-time. And that's how we, we, we won a big award for this. We, our work was published 10 years later by the world's leading research institute in Washington, the world's largest one, I should say. It was um, IEEE Spy Milestone Series as f for discovering the new physics laws that Kun Huang suggested existed. We were able to do that by making a formula of the music of the spheres from ancient Greece, which um, generated the image of a living seashell, which we lowered the formula, which was fractal. In my opinion, it was fractal. That was a very serious thing to say, because you're not allowed in the West to link the life to fractal. And I was adamant about this, so, and we made huge discoveries from this point of view. We lowered the um, mathematical formula by an octave, say an octave of music, and we got the fossil ancestor. Then we lowered it by less than an octave, say, and we picked up a very strange looking primitive creature, which was kept upright in the water by its design as it floated along ensnaring food. Now this creature was called Nipponites mirabilis and we were the first people in the world to link it to the living creature. 